I want to be the Prime Minister of India. Can I? Yes, you may. Why not? If Modi ji can be, so why not you? And Modi ji is greater man. So now he is greater. Before that? Before he was selling chai, so and I, I am not so. You are teaching. You are teaching English. You are so a trainer. I am teaching English, and it is from Angres, England. And England ruled India, and Indian people hate in England. Yes, sir. So if I come to the election, they will say English man. Oh. <laughs> right? It is not right. Hmm. We also need more number of police. Hmm. Like we are, we have not sufficient police and courts. So on this area, we need to work. I was in Patna. Hmm. I went to a place where uh, new metro line is being constructed, hmm. and I saw there some of the people are like tribal people are living in tent. When we give interview, like, or when we try to express something, so there is, a, there should be a meaningful topic, meaningful point from us, right? Interview means you will be asked a few questions and you will be answering those questions, right? It comes under your communication skill, right? It is the best thing to observe someone if someone is capable to just justify himself, to make you realize about himself that he is capable for this task or not. Just for example, if you go to MNC, we just give interview. If you go for interview, uh, like if you go for examinations of the governments, we have to just crack interview for A group and B group, right? Yes. Because we know interview is a such part where we can observe, where we can analyze, where we can know about the opposite person, that how is he and what is his situation. And the point is that when we give interview, then we have to make a criteria of this interview like what type of interview is this because we know that there are many types of interview there's formal interview there's informal interview there is casual interview there is lunch and dinner interview there is uh, some you know celebs interview and there are also exams interview and jobs interview as well all right but today we will be talking about it's this interview is just like a personal conversation type of interview right and uh, when you do personal conversation when you just try to answer something first of all listen the question that what is the question understand the core point of the question understand the meaning of the question and then answer that question right but first of all i just want to say in advance happy independence day 76th independence day to everybody all right so you're welcome and uh, it's very interesting point that you know, i have written a line key हमारे देश के लोगों का या जो है कि रक्त बहा है हमारे देश के वीर का और इसीलिए निशान बदला है हमारे हाथों की लकीर का सो राइट देश के वीरों ने दिया अपनी जान को ने उछावर और इसलिए हमारे पास है आज आज़ादी का पावर राइट ओके जहाँ चलेंगे वहाँ राह भारत बना देंगे जहाँ ठहरेंगे वहाँ भारत की इमारत बना देंगे दुनिया से कह दो कि थोड़ा सब्र करो आने वाले समय में दुनिया के हर कोने में तिरंगा फहरा देंगे दुनिया के हर कोने में तिरंगा राइट दिस इज द पॉइंट दैट वी ऑलवेज मस्ट बी प्राउड बीइंग एन इंडियन एंड बस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल दिस इज कॉल्ड द पेट्रोटिज्म सो पेट्रोटिज्म डज नॉट लाई इन वर्ड्स पेट्रोटिज्म डज नॉट लाई ऑलवेज इन योर ओरिट्री एंड इन स्पीकिंग पेट्रोटिज्म लाइज इन योर डीड्स इन योर एक्चुअली यू नो वर्क्स एंड टास्क when you do a good work for your country for your country's main for your country's people you are doing a great for society improvement right so you are doing good thing for your country and this is a great way to show your patriotism and nationalism right so nationalism is rashtravad and patriotism is desh bhakti right so let's start the interview session today and we will be starting the interview session so we will be putting some context of independence day as well and some other context also right so i would like to call first of first of all mr Mahesh, welcome. Please have a seat. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Please have a seat. Thank you very much. Okay. So, Mr. Mahesh, first of all, I want to know that uh, how are you feeling being the part of uh, India, being uh, uh, exactly, you know, uh, a citizen of India? How are you feeling? It is really like an amazing experience okay. when you live in a country which is so diverse hmm. and such a transparent system okay. right so we are going to celebrate the 76th independence day so what is your message for all the indian people message is always simple enjoy your independence your independence but also fulfill your duties at the same time because you are living in a country where your forefathers have built it it's also your duty that you leave this country after you that as a better place that you are living there 
exactly right and what is your like what do you think about india like you know what are the problems of india like what the challenges and problems india is facing right now as a country as we have only 76 year of independence we have faced many problems we are facing many problems we have solved many problems hmm. but now we have not solved we have also not solved many problems hmm. like for hunger we have solved hmm. the issue of hunger hmm. now we can say like okay for bpl or apl card holders we have free ration hmm. 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 but still like our in our country hmm. we are not very fit in certain human hmm. indexes hmm. like we don't have the level of that very high level of living index right. the environment and right. like the population hmm. and although like population is not fixed like after 2025 we are just going through 2.1 what are the reasons of this you know rapid uh, population growth and uh, do you think that only illiteracy is the cause of this and uh, what may be the other reasons according to you it is uh, like i can say illiteracy is the most reason like most important reason hmm for population growth like you can see by like if you plot the chart by a state and their per family child hmm. and their education ratio you will find it directly like right. if you go to kerala they are the lowest then you come to bihar and up you will find the highest hmm. like uh, bihar it is 3.2 and hmm. Hmm. for kerala it is 1.8 so. all right because kerala has the highest literacy yeah. rate and bihar has the lowest literacy lowest, lowest literacy exactly rate. so kerala mizoram tamil nadu this Uh, like you know states have highest yeah high, like you, you, know, you can think like if people are educated and they can see like if having more child hmm. will not make them happy right having fewer child and and providing them hmm. the quality life hmm. will be better for them but maybe they would be thinking that if they, they would be having this more children so they will be standing with the lord he okay papa hum aapke saath yeah, hai yeah this is like what you people used to think in hmm. earlier days hmm. but now they know it's like given the lord will not work Hmm. Like if you have any if the lathi will not work, then what will work now? You can go to police. They they are not a police agent, but there is a court. Hmm. Like we have independent judiciary. Hmm. So if you have any issue, you can go directly there. If police don't have. So do you think that Indian judicial system is that much capable or that much active to just listen us? It listens us, but like one issue that we find with Indian judicial system is not very quick. Hmm. it is very lengthy process mm. and very time consuming process mm. so this is the issue that we need to solve it could you tell me there are how many cases pending in india's courts there are 2 crore co- yeah. 2 crore cases yeah, are pending like, one thing i can say like mm. if you have an issue you can mm. go to court mm. and the court will take action so mm. this is something they do mm. so this is something good but like yeah you are right mm. we need to work on this issue like if we don't deliver the justice in time bound manner mm. then justice delay is justice denied So do you think that ki, like Nirbhaya case was there, and the ca- case wa- went for a long time, and now actually they have been punished just uh, last yeah, year? Yes, they should be have a judicial okay. system. So we have like very lengthy process. Like mm. even after the justice is delivered, mm. like we have to like presidential, mm. we can go to president and ask for mm. not getting punished. Mm. So those things are there still there. Mm. So like they are or like we have, we need more number of judges. Mm. We also need more number of police. Mm. like we are we have not sufficient police and courts so on this area we need to work and we have to increase our expenditure on this things so okay. we are as a poor country hmm. till now we don't have that so resources. what what do you think like you know ki if you become the prime minister of our country like of india what five steps would you like to have and take the we had a great conversation about some of the greatest points of exactly of our country he told us few things and he gave us also knowledge about some revolutions also what he told us right he told us about a uh, 5 trillion trillion economy achievement he also told us about he compared uh, some of the things like which we have we have improved in these years or in this uh, time right exactly under mr modi governance right okay so you are a dying fan of mr modi ji ki jai ho all right that's interesting Um, you are not his fan but you are what i like what he at a pass in the level then is done to acha matlab he he takes this is a firm decision maker yes sir it's firm decision maker yes, okay, fine that's great is it working mr chandra yes sir okay now i would like to call the next one and uh, i would like to call mr shafak yes. 
So now we have Shafak. So Shafak, how are you? I'm great. How about you? Yes, I'm very good. So what do you want to say about uh, our country, like being an Indian? What do you feel and how do you feel? I'm proud of an, I'm an Indian because our country is a beautiful country and an independent country. So I love my country. You love your country. You love your country because you are Indian or you love your country because India has some of the different and unique things? No, uh, it's not a reason like that. Yes, I'm proud because I'm Indian. So that's why I'm, I love my India. Hmm. Yes. And you are Indian. That's why you love your India. Yes. So you don't have the qualities of India. No, it has a, so many qualities. Tell me some of the qualities. Like uh, uh, if we want to do something, so we can. We have a right to do something. Hmm. We want to live free, uh, frankly, so we can live hmm. frankly. So these all are things. So do you think that ki India is a safe country for girls and uh, like you know girls are safe to do anything because I I heard a news of there was a chai wali ladki she was selling chai mm -hmm. and then she was attacked by some of the people. So what is this? Uh, this is a very bad thing because it is people don't think your leg is moving. Sorry, people <laughs> don't think so that way. girls they always turn to the girl hmm. so it is a very bad thing they don't do this thing because girls are also like a human hmm. they have also feelings so if you also if you want to leave so they can also leave but then why india is safe that you are talking about india is an independent india is a safe country so india what is india is safe country so you want to say In, india is not a safe india country india is safe country but not for the girls so you want to say you also want to be trapped like amir khan right <laughs> no. amir khan has been trapped India is not safe and now people are saying by court, by court, by court, right? So you also... India is safe but... Uh, India is not safe for girls. So why there is the 47% population of girls that are living in India? Not not for only for the girls, like of all girls, but some of the girls is... Uh, like we can take example of so many But girls. you said India is not safe for girls? Yes, I, I said India is not safe for the girls, but... Why did you say this? Like, because it's know? happening with our... It's happening in our country. No, all the girls are walking here on the road and they are going here but and there. how about that? But about that? So what about that? What about racism in America? What about uh, racism in America? What think about positive other? Things, so we should also think about negative things now. So India is a safe or not? <laughs> don't safe and don't also because girls are not safe in India. So girls want to go Pakistan? No, no, girls don't want to go Pakistan. Girls don't want to go Pakistan because when girls walking on the road, always boys like a uh, comment. So it happens in every country. Why you are saying that India is not safe for girls? I'm not any other country hmm. USA UK but so you I'm said a line like India is not safe for girls yes I'm saying India is not safe for girls yeah, it's, a, it's a wrong line India is not safe for girls why the, why then then Nepal is safe for girls <laughs> yes. Huh? I don't think so that ki Nepal is not safe for girls because I haven't gone there hmm. so only I'm I'm in India but it's a wrong line na? because if you are just uh, missing the line why you are saying it is it wrong why, according to you it is a wrong why yes. what is the reason behind you it are you are also here uh, everybody is here yes, there are girls there are girls girls are working in delhi so i am not saying this like Ajigad and Ajumbad, i don't know but you come yes to, that's not the same maafi mango that's not the same maafi mango why why but that after my constitution the constitution the constitution allows us to speak to express my point you said your point that is it's my point I can she can express, yes, right? No one can stop me because it is my right. That's the point. <laughs> All right, okay. So <laughs> uh, we will come to the conclusion. Don't worry. So India is safe for girls or not? No. No. My decision last. No. Okay, fine. What may be the opportunities for Indian in upcoming time? What are the opportunities? Being an Indian, what are the opportunities? Your leg is moving. <laughs> Wrong personality development. Yes, sir. Opportunities. Hmm. Like uh, what? To do something. Yes, in India. Like I'm an Indian. Yes, sir. My name is Muhammad Abdullah. Yes. So, what may be the opportunities for me if I live in India? Uh, your opportunity. So, you are Indian, you can get opportunity. No, I'm saying what are the opportunities. Like, for example. Uh, if you want to do something, you can. 
Nee, what I want to do? I want to be the Prime Minister of India. Can I? Yes, <laughs> why not? If Modi ji can be, so why not you? And Modi ji is greater man. So now he is greater. Before that? Before he was selling chai, so and I, I am not so. You are teaching. You are teaching English. You are so a trainer. I am teaching English, and it is from Angres, England. And England ruled India, and Indian people hate in England. Yes, sir. So if I come to the election, they will say Englishman. Wow. Right? It is not right. Don't it cast your own. Right. So that is we the point. We have a right. If we want, so we can. No, we have right to actually fight the election, but we yes. don't have the right place to fight it election. It's only up to the person. Na. If we want to make you the prime minister, they can make you. It's not up to you if you if you want to. You can. You should try first of all. Can I become the?